All right. I don't know if y'all can hear me or if I'm all muffled. I'm just going to... We're going to do this. We're going to do this. Because this is important. I can't, I, can't ha- I can't be all muffled and shit. I can't ha- be like misunderstood right now. Like I need to be understood. You know what I'm saying? I clean my screen. I need you to see me clearly. You see how cold it is out here? I'm out shivering. You know what I'm saying? But we just got the car fixed. But I'm not going to get tomorrow. Because they closed. But I was out. I took the bus. I've been out for like like two hours now, you know what I'm saying? We had a little bit of money left, so I was like, yo, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get some pizza for my family. They want some pizza. They've been doing really good. They've been stuck in the house. They've been just grinding, just trying to just trying to live, just trying to be like happy and productive, you know what I'm saying? And these kids are doing so good. I got I got, you know, a little soda, I got some pizza, I got some breadsticks, I got some cookie dough. We're just gonna do it up. We had like 13 bucks and somehow we made it all happen, you know what I'm saying? And sometimes like, shit, yo, like, all you got is that little bit, you know what I mean? And like, and you just keep at it, you know what I'm saying? You can do it. I'm, I'm saying, I, I just wanna encourage my people right now, you know what I'm saying? Like, it don't even matter. You come from nothing, you come from nowhere. You got no name, you got no brands, you got no ride, no bus money, you know what I'm saying? I took I took bus tokens. I got bus tokens from the from the food bank, you know what I'm saying? Like I didn't even have money to come down here. People like, you know, don't look at me like, oh, oh, oh he could oh he could talk. He can talk because he's successful. Oh he can talk because he's he's got a lot of shit. I don't. I'm telling you right now, like I don't, you know what I'm saying? I'm I'm gonna be real fucking I'm gonna be real real on here, you know what I'm saying? This is this is more the beginning of my journey, you know what I'm saying? I'm I'm 38, but this is like more the beginning of my journey to success, you know what I'm saying? Like I've been I've been doing all kinds of shit, but these last few years have been really this is when I've been grinding. This is when I've been like figuring out I I need to get up early, you know what I'm saying? And like truth be told you know what i mean like i'm i'm pushing for that 120 you know what i mean but fuck dude i woke up yesterday i woke up and i've been i've been listening to eric thomas and he's like yo i get up at three o'clock every day i get up at three o'clock i put in 120 i don't fuck around i hit the snooze button i don't uh you know i'll sleep in like that and i i tell you what like i woke up three o'clock on the dot I was like, damn, should I get up? And it was like, I got, to, you got, that's when you got to really utilize that five second rule. Like I was before that five seconds is up. I was like, okay, get up, get up. And I was like, what am I going to do? Fuck. I don't know. Put, you know, I edited a video, you know, got some stuff together, got that ready to be published. And then, and then I was sitting there and I was like, damn I'm tired like it's I don't want to wake people up at three o'clock in the morning you know what I mean trying to make some coffee or doing something like what am I gonna do like it's too cold to go outside and fucking I mean I'll freeze my ass off but I made all these excuses about staying up about being up at three o'clock in the morning you know what I did I excused myself right back into bed and by 3:45, oh man, my fucking my arm hurts. My hand is freezing. By 3:45, I was back in bed, and I went to sleep. And I didn't get back out of bed till like shit. I don't know, eight o'clock or something. You know what I'm saying? And it was like I I I challenged myself. And I, and I failed at that. I challenged myself and I failed. But you know what I did? I said, all right, that was my first failure today. And you know what? I'm going to keep pushing through. And I'm going to have faith in myself that I can do more. That I can get the stuff done that I still need to do. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I didn't make it up at 3 o'clock. So what? 
I keep going, you know what I'm saying? That's not the only goal that I have in the day. That's not the only thing that I want to do with my life. Is that, one, oh, I get up at 3 o'clock and then everything, everything else is cake during the day. Fuck no. So I just kept going. I just kept going. I kept crushing. And you know what? I crushed goals all day long. I put in as much as I, of myself as I could and did everything that I needed to do that day. And so, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just wanted to be transparent. Like, this morning, you know, I woke up 4.45. Like, I usually wake up, like, by myself around 4.30, 4.45. And damn, it's early, you know what I mean? And that for a long time, I've been wanting to get... I'm talking, like, two years. I've been really wanting to get up at, at 4 o'clock in the morning and get my grind on, you know what I'm saying? And, and it's it's... It's hard. It's hard work. I got four kids. I got a pregnant wife. I got I got other things going on. I got work. When we were working, like it was like we were putting in 60 hours a week and shit working at the Grand Canyon. You know what I mean? It was not easy. Um and I haven't, you know what I mean? And I'm coming to the point where whatever it takes, I'm gonna fucking push through. I don't care if it's hard. I don't care if it's painful. I'm going to do it. And I may have failed. I don't matter. I could fail a thousand times. But I'm going to be winning. And before you know it, I'm going to be winning that shit. I don't give a fuck. I got people. I'm out in the fucking parking lot. I got people looking at me like, what you doing? I'm encouraging my people. I don't care what anybody thinks about it. I got people walking by looking at me like, what is you doing? I don't care. I ain't worried about that. They, that that's, that's not my problem. That's not my concern. My concern is you. My concern is me. It's my family. My future. It's my family. My tribe. My people. You know what I'm saying? So I'm on here and it's like, you know, I gotta I gotta freeze my fucking hand off, you know what I'm saying, to hold this right now. Cause I I, I didn't bring my my tripod and you know it, my gloves will turn off the video or something. I need you to hear this, you know what I'm saying? That, like, you just keep grinding. Like, I'm out here because I love my family. I'm out here. I texted him. He's like, I hope you know I love you. <laughs> it's like, I haven't checked the temperature because m- my hands are so cold. <laughs> but, you know what I'm saying? Like, I love them. I want them to know that, you know what I mean? I want them to feel that every day. And so, I just want to, you know, encourage you just just share my life with you you know what I mean that you like that you just like hug your kids a little tighter today you know what I'm saying we don't know how long we got I was talking about time yesterday that was morning I don't even know when I published that everything just coming I'm just I'm just grinding every day just trying to like put in as much as I can and put out as much as I can you know what I'm saying but you know tell your people that you love them tell your friends that you love them Sarah taught me that Sarah always whenever she leaves her friends or something anybody that she knows if she knows you and and she's got a relationship with you she loves you and she will tell you I love you when she leaves she said I love you I I didn't grow up with that shit. I got the bus here. Oh, what up? All right, the bus just picked up. So, anyway, I just wanted to be an encouragement to my people. I hope y'all can hear this. I love you. I do. If you're on my feed, you know what I'm saying? Like, I may not even know you, but I got a big heart. You know what I'm saying? And so, I just want you to know that you're loved and that... uh, you know what I'm saying? You got you got people pushing for you. So anyway, I'm gonna get off this. Alright, peace.